Welcome to Clean Radio, helping to navigate the journey of recovery by removing the stigma and offering a choice for a new life. We were the epitome of the mentally ill. We were <laughs> drug addicts, thank you. And all and they didn't talk about drugs. They didn't they talked about alcohol a little bit, but they were always talking about steps and pro, and and meetings and stuff. So they didn't understand. So we had a lot of opinions. So the so the guy comes to us and he says, <clears throat> you know, this is your only hope. It's the only thing that's ever worked for anybody. And it doesn't work for everybody because you gotta want it. So you better know what you want before you dismiss it. So you might try listening. And you, he turns to me and he says, you've got a lot of anger issues. If I were you, I would get a sense of humor. If you don't have a sense of humor about who you are, what you've done, and where you're going, you're in for a rough ride because life gets really tricky. And it was like simultaneous, get a sense of humor, bing, meditate, you know, get deeply rooted in a spiritual program. And that happened on that moment that day, and that was 30 years ago.